good Wednesday morning. My boo's off work. Um, we're at Ikea. We're going to deep couch sit on that couch. <laughs> and we're going to see how we feel about it. Um, oh my God. I'm still waiting for the sales guy to get back to me about the couch we really are leaning towards. But we're gonna go try this out and leave it as the other option. So, fun. I see it. That's the white one. Oh, it's so little though. This is, this is, this would be the dog cover. The one with the dog slip cover. This would be the one we put on when guests came over. Yeah. This one, they have this too, but this is more expensive. I don't feel like that matte. It almost has like a green tinge to it. Right? How are you feeling? I feel like a giant on this couch. Do you? No? I really like this cushion cover. I wonder if they sell that. Huh? No, but that's an expensive couch. I don't know how I feel about this still. I think if we... Look guys, I have a pimple. What the hell? I like woke up with a pimple. If, um... If we can't get the star one, I guess we'll get this. But I don't like the, the switched out slip cover I thought I did. So... So I think we'll just stick with one slip cover that we wash for now comes because we're just gonna take it ourselves and put it together. Look how big these boxes are. I'm so glad we have a truck. I really don't know what's going off my face. I was gonna film today but now I have a pimple I don't want to. Why do I have a pimple? I never have pimples. I should be grateful I used to have that acne. It's just one pimple. Baby bird. Oh it got stuck in like glue. Oh my god, what is that? Is he okay? Can he move or is it like matted on him? No, he's like... Yay, we saved him! Where'd he go? He's still like, he's got matted. His wings are matted. <clears throat> I don't know if there's anything there to do. What if we washed him? What? Huh? glue all over him. I'm trying to see if he's hurt. He doesn't look actually hurt. It's I know, just... it's like he can't move because he's covered in glue. Did he bite you? Yeah. I'm trying to get this stuff out of his mouth. What if we took him home and let him take a bath? And then set him free? It's like his feet are binded and everything. Yeah, he's like just covered in this sticky mess. He's Yeah, he's not hurt. Can we take him home and clean yeah, do him? Do have something to hold him in? Oh, he's covered in glue. We don't think he's injured. We're going to try to take him to a wildlife bird place and see if they can help him. If not, we're going to take him home and wash him and see if we can get the glue off of him, feed him some worms, try to see if he can be set free. I feel so bad. Poor little guy. We're going to get you help. So scared. I feel so bad. So we, oh, it unfocused. I've named him Charlie. Obviously, I know he's a wild animal and he needs to be with people that know how to care for him. So we're going to drop him at a wildlife refuge and then continue with our day. But it makes us really sad. People were just passing him and you could see him like flapping around and struggling. He was freaking out and I don't know what that was, like glue or paint or something. I, I couldn't tell what it was. It was some kind of adhesive it looked like. He's just, it's stuck all over him. It's going to be okay, Charlie. I'm having a hard time finding this place. Do you see it? All my education is there. Well, that's probably the same thing. What was it that down there say? Wildlife, yeah. Here it is. Wildlife Center. It's okay. 
He's so much calmer now. When we picked him up, he was like, <gasps> like freaking out. I think he knows he's gonna be okay. Wow. Huh? Yeah. We made a donation to them when we uh, admitted him just to try to like, you know, the places like this need stuff like that, so maybe we'll start donating to them regularly. Oh god, it's so hot. The, I guess she's a vet, Yeah. said he looked, it's a sparrow, and she said he looked okay. Like he didn't look injured, he just looked like it was just glue on him, and they think that once they get the glue off, it was a boy, I was right. Um, once they get the glue off, that he'll probably be okay. Um, I'm sure he'll have to like stay here for a couple weeks and. But yeah, cause like all of his feathers were missing on the bottom. <clears throat> where, yeah. Yeah, he was just stuck down by his belly. And he got stuck to the cup. I feel bad, but there was no other way. Yeah, if we had been carrying him in a napkin, then there'd just be napkins all stuck. Yeah, down. but she was able to get the cup off and she has some kind of stuff she was spraying on him and they said that we can call tomorrow and check on him if we want. Well, now we have to go on with our day. <laughs> it was a weird break in the day, but it was well worth it. Thank you for giving in to my crazy animal loving spirit. Well, leave him there. I don't know, some people, uh, you saw the people that walked past him and just looked at him and then kept walking. Well, I'm not those people. I know. Maybe there's you. No, I'm definitely not those people. Maybe I'll start volunteering at this place so I can check on Charlie. <laughs> hey guys, I think I'm going to start donating to this place more often. They actually have a GoFundMe page. So I thought I would see that's the um, GoFundMe information. So you see, um, it is, it says that they receive no financial assistance from the government or state, relying solely on donations from private and corporate donors and charitable giving foundations and people like you and me. Um, they do not turn away any animals. Um, uh, blah, 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 blah. So what I'm gonna do in the description box below is I'm gonna leave a link to their GoFundMe if y'all are interested in donating. It's really cool, they took him right away. They had the cutest squirrels and possums and I didn't film too much because I don't want to look like a weirdo but like they had so many animals in there that's just so I that's incredible um yeah I just thought I'd share that with you in case you guys like and it's all tax deductible in case you guys like giving donations and stuff like that okay guys so while we were rescuing Charlie the sales guy from Star Furniture texted us and he said he'll give us a 20% off so we finally get the couches we want for the same price as the Ikea couches, which is like, I told Justin, that's our good karma for being good human beings and helping a poor animal out. So we're going to get the nail head couches. Um, I'm so excited because both of them turned out to be like the same price as the Ikea stuff, right? Yeah. Pretty much. So we're so excited. We're going to go buy them now. And they're such a good quality, like... It's such a steal. It's such a steal. Cover these. <laughs> okay, guys, we just bought two of these, but they won't be until September. So that's the couches we went with. Okay, guys, I am finished with the bathroom. What do y'all think of that? I totally love it. The only thing that sucks is these don't fit in there, and I thought it was because I got like a bigger one that looked more real, but I tried the little T ones. They don't fit either. But I think it looks okay. Can y'all see them flickering? And they're like LEDs, so they last a long time. I'm gonna flip it around and show you guys the rest of the bathroom. The only thing I have left to do is a few paint touch-ups. Um, and I need to, what was the other thing? I need to find a hand towel. I'm still not sure how I like the rug. My friends like the rug, but it's actually an older rug. I had already, I just don't know how I feel about it. I'll let you guys see what you think. And I need to find a hand towel. I think I want to get like a monogrammed one with like our initials. So I'm going to show you guys now. Okay, we'll focus. All right, so there is the candle 
flickering. Oh, well, you can't really tell when it's flickering, but yeah, there's the thing I found at Hobby Lobby and it was on sale for, I think it was like half off. Um, and I bought the candles with it. Those weren't on sale. They were $3.99 a two pack and it all came out to $50. So I got that for that wall. And we've had that tissue holder. We've had that toilet holder. Um, we've had this thing, towel ring, and I need a towel for that. This is the rug. They used to be our entryway rug. Um, now we have those other ones, but Amber kind of ruined the big one. So this one's still in decent condition. I think it looks okay in here. I just don't know yet. Hopefully once, if I get a brown towel, it'll make it kind of pull it together. So anyways, um, we got a new faucet. Justin got that thing situated. It's an antique bronze. It's hard to tell in this lighting, like with the camera. Um, this is that frame we got at Kirkland's and we've had that bronzy light. So, and then we got this light switch that's new. I don't know why I flipped it. That's new, we changed out the plates. So, oh, one room down. <laughs> but I really do like this color. Um, yeah, I think it's nice. What do you guys think? Anyway, I'm gonna end the vlog for today and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, bye.